What's going on, everybody? See here, and welcome back to some more Icarus. So, in the last episode, if you missed it, we got our we got our rifle. We finally got our rifle. Oh my gosh, it feels so good. We are able to survive the things and the stuff. It feels good. It, feel, it does. It feels really good. But we've got a lot of other stuff that we need to do. Um, so now that we have the rifle, which is cool and all, we're kind of ahead. Like, okay, so we've got the weaponry. We need to get some other survivability options going here. We have no armor, um, and there's just like some other quality of life upgrades that we could get. Now, I do, I need to get, I need to light this place up better. I know, I am aware, and I'm sorry. I've seen the comments. We need to get on that. And also, um, there's a, apparently a whole nother tree here. So there's, there's resources, exploration, hunting, cooking. Am I missing another tree? Somebody told me that there was another tree. Oh, yes. There's survival, habitation, and combat. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Yes, I am. Um, <laughs> okay. So, let's look at combat here. Bows, crossbows, spears, blades, firearms. Firearms, fire. Okay. That is what we need. Um, cheaper bulk rifle ammo. Minus 25% crafted ram, uh, rifle ammo resource cost. That is amazing. Firearms way less in your inventory. Let's get that. That's a huge deal. Faster rifle reloading, increased damage. With, like these are all good things. Uh, minus 25% carry weight. Are they all right? How much does this rifle weigh? One kilogram. I think we'll be okay with that. Um, yeah, I completely didn't even see these up here. Oh man. Increased stamina regeneration. Oh, that'd be nice. Discount thatch, discount wood, discount stone. Well, okay, for reduced capture cost of taming equipment, increased foraging yield, back to saddle, reduce, reduce crafting cost of that. That's pretty cool. Well, reduced durability loss on all axes. Oh, there's like durability for stuff too. That's pretty cool. Um, I'm going to go with the pew pews though. Let's do faster reloading as well. And, oh, I can't do another one yet. So... I want faster reloading. Maybe firearms weigh less. No, nah, I don't really feel like we need that. All right, and we'll do another. We'll do it. We'll do that. We'll do another 15% uh, reloading. We're going to be rifle experts. What is like how many shots did you count? Chance of not consuming ammo. New life. Chance that gun gains durability on a breaking shot. Haha, <laughs> that's kind of cool. Sharpshooter increase critical hit multiplier. Oh, see, that's going to be nice. Uh, reduce bullet spread. Yes. Okay. So we've got that going. Um, maybe we should spend a little bit of time and work on the house here. Let's see what we got for. I don't have a lot of points though. Is the problem? Like we have the fire pit or the fire pit. We do have a standing torch, a freestanding torch. That that might actually be a better option for us. Um, that would take a point though. That would take a point. And then I would like to get some armor of some sort. So let's see. What do we have? What can we do? Anything for tier three armor? So we have the advanced textiles bench. We could unlock that. We have the things for that. But what do we require here? Platinum weave? What in tarnations is platinum weave? I have no idea. Cured leather. Cured leather. Oh, we're probably going to... That's probably going to need like a drying rack. And what is platinum weave? Hunter chest armor. Oh, that sounds exciting. Crouching movement speed. Minus 25% perceived threat. Plus 5% stamina regen. Plus 10% health regen. Whoa! This stuff gives us plus 10% health regen and plus 10% stamina regen. Um, that's pretty cool. So, let's see. If we wanted to go this route. I don't know what Platinum Weave is, to be honest. Um, maybe that's made in here. We do also have the biofuel composter, which will give us the ability to get biofuel. And if we get biofuel, is there a biofuel generator? There's a biofuel radar. I wonder if there's a bio, is there a biofuel generator? Like, how do we make electricity? So we have in this option, we have the ability to make a basic wall light, right? But it requires power. Where do we get the start of power? That's what I'm trying to figure out here. I would think it's in here. Being that one of the first things we can unlock is a basic light, but I don't see 
I don't see an option for for some kind of generator of sorts. There's a okay, so there's a biofuel generator in tier four, but that requires level thirty. So what is the point in this? I don't understand this. What is the point in having a light in tier three? I don't I don't get that. Unless there's unless there's something else I'm missing here. Okay, what is going on out here? I have seen I've heard so many things getting hit by this. Holy oh. It's because something died in there and something else was trying to eat it. No way. Oh, it's a Komodo. They were trying to eat the <laughs> That's so funny. They were trying to eat it and they got killed. Oh my gosh, that's great. I love it. Okay. I'm trying to figure out where I'm trying to figure out where the power is at here. So we have two points. I'm going to go ahead and unlock this advanced textiles bench um, because like, like I said, I'd like to get some armor here. Now, as far as I can see for power stuff, the only power stuff I can see is in tier four. Um, and then we get like a biofuel generator. And then if we keep going up here, there's the water wheel um, and things like that. Oh, water sprinkler. Oh, I can't wait to get into this stuff. This stuff's going to be so much fun, but I don't really have a, a means to get electricity right now. Also, there's our hunting rifle. So I'm not even sure why some of this stuff is in here. Like, I don't, I don't understand why this, like this basic wall light. I don't, why is it here? Because it needs power. Basing ceiling light requires power. Why? There's no power here. Unless I'm missing something. I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, but let's go ahead and let's get this, um, let's get this workbench and let's see what we need for that. And then I guess maybe the standing torch so that way we can actually see what the heck's going on because we just can't see anything in here okay so let's see where is our floor torch at is it in this crafting menu yes it is okay so we need some sulfur let me go ahead and steal some sulfur out of here and let's go and make some uh some of these floor torches how many can i make four of them fantastic all right look at that oh we got one floor torch hopefully it doesn't burn the floor and above it there's another one. Another one. And then let me grab some sticks. Oh my gosh. We can actually see what the heck's going on. No, no way. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, it's just so beautiful. You know, we really don't even need these wall torches anymore. Actually, I'm going to pick this one up. I'm going to move this guy. I'm gonna put it over here on the stone wall so we can see better. The only thing is that these torches can use wood. These ones can only use sticks, I believe. Which kind of is a bummer, but you know what? It is what it is. So we can see a little bit better, okay? All right, looks looks better. Now, let's get this, uh, let's see if we can get this other bench made here. Now, where do we make this bench at? It's probably in the workbench. So we have our textiles bench. It's the advanced textiles. Did we actually unlock it? No, we didn't actually unlock it. Okay, so let's go ahead and unlock that. Advanced textiles bench. Okay, so we need iron, wood, epoxy, rope, and steel screws. So iron, wood, epoxy, and rope. So it looks like I need wood and iron. Do I have any more iron down here? Don't have any iron in there. Where's our mortar and pestle at? Perfect. Okay, so I have a little bit more iron in here. Let's go ahead and get that smelted up. All right, then we need to go ahead and get some wood. Anybody out here want to eat my face? Always like to do a nice little check. Nah, I don't see anything. All right, let's go grab a bunch of wood. Oh, are you kidding me? There's a storm. A flash storm. Wonderful. Let's just grab a little bit of wood while we're out here. <laughs> we'll be fine. We'll beat the flash storm, right? Maybe? Alright, flash storm's coming in. Um, I am a little bit worried about my walls here. Because if any of those catch on fire, like we're not going to have a good time. So, probably need to make sure that I have a fire thwacker ready to go. Uh, I need a little bit of stone for that. 
We have another rain reservoir? Hold on a second. We need to get that placed out. Yeah, it sounds really, really bad out there. Let's craft up a couple of those. Okay, everything looks all right. I'm going to go place this rain reservoir out here. I didn't know we had a second one. That place like right here. You know, I almost had this. I saw it green for a second. Now I can't, <laughs> I can't get it. Darn it. Um, let's put it right there. That'll work. Okay. Nothing catch on fire. Well, that caught on fire, but that's okay. All right. So all we're missing is the iron and then we can get our textiles bench and then we can see what the heck this platinum weave is. I'm really hoping it doesn't require actual platinum. <laughs> Because if it requires actual platinum, we're not going to have a good time. All right. So go ahead and craft that bad boy. All right. Let's see here. So, you know, this is a good, this is a good one to start up here, right? Okay. Uh, oh, there it is. Platinum. Oh my God. It requires platinum. Ah, <sighs> okay. Well, so... That's unfortunate. That's really, really unfortunate. <laughs> Reason that's unfortunate is because I don't think I actually, did we unlock the steel tools yet? Um, I didn't unlock the steel pickaxe yet. And the steel pickaxe is what we're going to need. And I have no points available, zero points available. And we're not even close to another level. So I can't get that platinum. So we can't get platinum weave. Um, okay. But what we could do is we could work, to work towards what we're going to need. So we're going to need platinum. We're also getting cured leather, which cured leather is probably made in the drying rack. A rack for slowly drying various cuts of meat and curing leather. So I need a point for that. I need a point for that's just absolutely fantastic. That is just so exciting. I'm just so excited about that, you know, very excited. Um, Okay, so let's do this then. Let's get the textiles bench. Can we get like... Do we have the leather backpack still? Do we still have a leather backpack on us? I hope we do. We have a leather backpack. All right. Um, I really, if I refresh talents, would that give me all my points back? So we could like use what we need to use. Cause like, I don't need to, I don't need the wood bow and stuff like that anymore. Oh, it didn't do nothing. Refresh talents. It did nothing. Ah. Uh. Well, I guess what we could do is I could go resource farming. I mean, I need wood. I need stone. I need iron. I need absolutely everything. Anyways, um, I have the tools that I need to make that stuff happen right now. There's a wolf right there. Let's use our bow. Tag your it. Got you. Okay. Let's go and grab. Oh, God. Did I break my foot? S sprained ankle. <laughs> yeah, I might just have to do a little bit of farming. We need to get some points. I need to get some materials anyway. So I think that's going to be the goal. Ooh, a tree landed right in the fire. Hopefully, that's not an issue. Uh, you know what we probably should do? Let's go ahead and get some of this fiber before it's all gone. Ah, inventory's full. Quickly! Bambi, run away! The fire's gonna get you! Oh, that wolf's on fire. The wolf is on fire! And guess what? Boom, he's dead. And then that Komodo's gonna come over there and try to eat him while he's on fire, too. <laughs> They're so stupid. What was it, carrot? Oh, another carrot. Bambi, don't do it. What are you doing? Inventory is full again. Come on, I was going to come over here and eat that. Oh my gosh. It's burning down everything. All right. I'm going to try to get this tree before it gets claimed. All right. So I did a little bit of mining here. Um, We've got, well, I basically cleared, it, cleared out my inventory, but we got a bunch of, we got some wood, we got some oxide, some sulfur, some silica, some things like that. I just basically mined around the area. I want to pop back into here and see if 
the cave is still messed up or if it's better now. <laughs> um, I want to go, I'm going to need another torch though. Let me see if I have a torch that I can utilize. I don't think so. I'm just going to grab some fibers some sticks. We're going to make another torch and wood rag torch. Perfect. Craft that bad boy. And let's see if this cave has fixed itself a little bit. Because before what we were having the issue with is that the, um, the worms were immediately respawning. So if, as long as they don't immediately respawn, we'll be fine. Ooh. Okay, so there's those. It doesn't look like the cave is doing its thing anymore. It looks like we might be okay. Oh, okay. Perfect. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and mine this and uh, get this stuff collected up. Yes, this is perfect. Okay. I was a little bit, I was kind of bummed out about it because like, I was like, man, this mine's broken. Oh, you know what? Um, well, too late. We're already in here now. So I was going to say we need to get some stuff for the anti stuff, but you know what? I don't even think we have the anti uh, pneumonia stuff unlocked yet. So, and there's the pneumonia. Wonderful. Oh no, the cave broke. So when it lights up like that, that means it's broke, I think. Well. Yes. Because it's, it thinks we left, and I think it's, it's going to think that we're back outside, but I mean, I'll try to, I'm going to try to grab everything I can while I'm in here. <gasps> deep mining ore deposit? Coal and ore deposit that can be drilled with deep mining equipment. Ooh. All right. Yep. Yeah, see, there they are. They all respawned because it went back to cave mode. Man. All right, we'll just grab this coal right here. I mean, we got some of it. Yeah, see how it's all lit up right now? Thanks for outside the cave, but as soon as I go further, it's going to like reset it. Oh, there we go. Back to being a cave. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what the deal is. I'm not really sure what the deal is with this one. All right, so we're going to need steel. But I know we need iron, so let me go ahead and get a little bit of iron in there. Let's go ahead and activate that bad boy. And then let's go make some more steel bloom. So we'll go ahead and put those in there, those in there. Steel bloom max. 27, that's it? What is the requirement? Oh, it's a 6 to 1 ratio. Holy moly. Alright, that's fine. Um, and then I guess we could probably go ahead and make some more gunpowder. Oh, it sounds like there's a dog outside. Attacking something. Oh, there definitely is. Oh. Okay. Komodos versus two wolves. Oh, another Komodo moving in here. Man, these walls are just like the, it's like an arena here. Like these animals are just after, look at, look at them go. Oh, 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 taking damage. Oh gosh. Oh, they're going down. Oh, Komodo, is a Komodo gone? Komodos are gone. Wow. Komodos are gone. Unfortunately, the wolves are not leaving to see the next day because that is free resources that I need. Wait, will you seriously attack? You seriously attack the wall? Uh, okay. Those walls do actually pretty good damage. Holy moly. Be gone. 
Sorry, bud. Oh my gosh, there's a there's a Kia here. There's a uh, oh I can't carry. Oh, darn it, I can't carry another one. Ooh, there's a Jaguar. Holy moly, why were you here? All right, we got to go grab everything from outside. Like we got a whole bunch of goodies out there. Um, actually, do I have any corn? Corn, give me something. That that. That give me a little bit of give me a little bit of buffs when I when I'm down. So I have an issue with the workbench here. Um, it's not actually it's not actually crafting anything. Oh, it's because it's full. Clear queue, craft. Yeah, it was full. Okay, holy moly, we had a crafting bench already completely full of stuff. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah, we've got a lot of things here to, uh, go ahead and get processed as well. <laughs> you know what? Actually, hold on. Let me go into here. I think I made another, yeah, I made some more cupboards so that way we get more things stored and organized and can we throw a cupboard like maybe just right next to this guy? Actually. We throw one in here no that's not gonna work darn all right more swords over here all right so all that's good let's go ahead and throw all this meat that we just got into the fire here we'll grab those out of there that looks good 46 okay cool so everything is looking good there <laughs> just kind of doing a little bit of everything we are almost at level 26 which is fantastic uh just by doing some random little cleanup kind of stuff it's, it's quite nice actually uh, let's see. We've got some gold. I don't know what to do with the gold yet. I'm going to go ahead and just throw it in here. We could process it down, but I just, I don't want to process it yet because I don't know what I need it for. Oh my gosh. We have another wolf over here. You know, this is turning into like an XP farm. All right. So there's a wolf. Yep. I'm going to hurt my foot. Of course. But like... If I bring this in here, what happens if I just set this like right here? How many things will try to get to that wolf and kill themselves on the outside? Like that's what I'm, <laughs> that's what I'm curious about. I don't actually see anything now trying to come to get it. <laughs> Darn it. All right, we're almost at 26. See if we can hit 26. There we go, baby. We got it. We got 26. Okay, so what we need now, I believe, is we need to upgrade our pickaxe so that way we can mine platinum so we can get platinum weave so then we can get better armor. So we're going to need a platinum weave. Uh, we're going to need a platinum. We're going to need a better pickaxe. And then we're going to need the drying rack in order to get the dried, um, the, the dried stuff. Uh, and then I think that's it. I, you know, I don't know <laughs> these points. We just need somebody. I wish we got like five points per level instead of, uh, four. Cause it's, it makes it really hard for solo players to, uh, to get all the, the materials that they need. So, uh, we need the drying rack because we're going to need that for our, uh, our stuff. Um, our higher tier armor because we're going to need the, like the dried leather. And then let's go ahead and we're going to need the... The steel pickaxe. Yeah, we're gonna need that. And then the other point I'm gonna leave for now because I don't I don't wanna like get everything all at once here. So what do we need for the drying rack? So I just need some wood for that. Let's go ahead and get that, and then let's go ahead and get how many of these can we make? One? Let's just make I guess we'll make we'll make the one to start with. And we'll see how much leather we can actually put on the thing. I think we need to put a, um, might need to put some more foundations down here or something. Cause we need something to walk on, you know, something nice and flat, but we'll figure that out. So let's figure this out here. Okay. Let's put that down. So interact. So let me go grab a bunch of leather and we'll see how this works here. So if I grab that, th that 30, 
Will it hold like a stack? Like, I don't, I'm not sure how this works. Select a recipe. Huh. Oh, oh, we need, okay. Uh, leather and tree sap. Oh, that's actually fantastic. Cause guess we got a lot of tree sap. So let me actually go in here. Let's grab, oh my gosh. Let's grab half of our leather and tree sap. Is that in here? No, we have a bunch in here. Oh yes. Okay. Let's grab those and we'll get some cured leather going here. Holy moly. Put all those in, put all those in. Oh snap. Oh, it takes 33 seconds per deal. Oh wait, hold on. There's probably not enough room. Okay. Oh my gosh. That's going to take forever. Actually, let's do that. Let's swap that out. Cause I think we got one for one. Yeah. We're going to, we're going to need a lot more uh, tree sap here. That's going to take forever. So since that's going to take forever, we definitely need to go get more sticks and we need to make more of those for sure. Um, yeah, please. All right, we're going to get two more of these things going uh, because that is, I mean, that's crazy. 30 seconds per, I mean, let's just do one per, no, it's doing one. <laughs> doing one at a time. Yeah, we need more than one of these um, for sure. So let's go ahead and get uh, that one there. And now these do have a health on them. <gasps> Shoot. These need to go inside. Yeah, these need to go inside, otherwise they're going to break. I didn't even think about that. Wow, really? I can't even put another one right here that says it's colliding. Well darn. Alright, so we've got some tree sap going here. <laughs> We've got some leather going. Okay, I'm, I'm not gonna do any more leather though because like I want to keep some leather to to make leather stuff with, you know. Like, uh, so let's go and take some of those. We'll throw those in here. Okay, so we've got some being made in all three of those. That's fantastic. So that's done. Now uh, we need to make our platinum pickaxe, which is. Uh, located iron oh steel steel pickaxe so we need steel epoxy okay i think actually uh we've got the epoxy throw that in there and then we should have some steel right down into here we do indeed we'll take those actually deactivate this bad boy too thank you thank you we'll get our steel pickaxe going Boom, steel, I, that, I don't have a steel pickaxe, right? Iron pickaxe, okay, cool, craft, boom, yes! Upgrades, all right, so put that in here, put this into here. Now, um, I wonder if we can sneak into here and grab that platinum. I don't know which one platinum is. Are you platinum? Platinum, yes, ha ha ha! All right, so this will give us some platinum and then we can make some platinum weave and we could probably, what is this? Titanium, I'll take it, I'll take it. All right, I'm not sure what we need to uh, smelt these down, but let's see, platinum. Oh, it takes five for a platinum. Ooh, that's gross. So it takes five platinum ore for one, five titanium ore for one. Oh, oh, that's terrible. Wow. Okay. So that means that armor is super expensive. It takes platinum. You're making, it requires platinum to make some regular freaking leather stuff. Are you kidding me? Well, I mean, okay. There's the leather stuff, but like, Cured leather chest. Why does that take platinum weave? Why do these take platinum? I don't even understand. I want this stuff. I want the hunter chest stuff. Um, I think that's cold resist, heat resist, perceived threat, exposure resistance. 
I mean, I like this stuff because I like the health and stamina region. You know what, though? Honestly, the health and stamina regen is it's very nice. Yeah, I think we're actually going to go with this stuff right here. Just because I think it's... I honestly, I think it's better than... Because the stamina and health regen alone. Um, better cold resistance, better heat resistance, better... Well, it doesn't have better exposure... Um, how much physical resistance does this have? This has 12 physical. Well, that has 12 physical as well. But I like the I like the health and stamina regen on this, so I think we're gonna go with that stuff. Um, and you know what? Actually, cured head armor. Let's go ahead and let's unlock. Should we unlock a piece? Let's unlock that piece right there. We'll unlock the chest, and maybe we'll actually even make the chest right now. We'll have to see though. Okay, so we have two platinum ingots. And I think we're gonna need some fibers, if I'm not mistaken. And then we need, it's this one up here, isn't it? Okay, so platinum weave. Are you kidding me? Does it only, it only makes one? Does it really only make one? That's so expensive. That is so crazy expensive. Oh my gosh. I don't understand why it requires platinum to make that. Like that, are you, are you it's, what? I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. Why is that, why is platinum required for that? I have no idea. Uh, let's check our cured leather here. So we've got eight here. We should, we should have enough to make our, um, to make our piece. Let's drop those in there Go ahead and make another one of those and then that should be yeah so there's our first piece of armor craft that and let's put that on i love how you put it over the eva suit <laughs> like it's on the end i don't even care it don't matter it don't matter because it's doing its thing we've got our first piece of armor here oh it feels good feels good can't even tell it's on there but i think we have some resistances to some stuff <laughs> so and then once we get the whole set we'll get um plus 10 percent health regen and plus 10 percent stamina regen so we're gonna have to get some more uh we're gonna have to get some more levels you know what actually really stinks too is that i'm gonna have to get two more levels just to get the complete set because we only get three points per time so yeah that's gonna be rough man two more levels we're gonna need for that but then we'll have full armor. Um, we'll have a decent set of armor, I guess I should say. And we probably honestly, in, in all honesty, we probably should have went with the first stuff first because that would give us cold resistance <laughs> and we could go in the Arctic area and do a whole bunch of stuff, but uh, I don't care. I think we're good. And that is going to end this episode. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Um, we kind of, we're at the place where we're just kind of like trying to get some XP, trying to get some points. And I'm really like, honestly, the points are what's killing me right now. I would have a whole lot more to do. But the problem is I almost have to just like go out and level things to unlock things. Because there's a lot of things that I'd want to play with. But this whole like point system, like, okay, I have to, it's, t it's time gated essentially. Like I need to play for another hour to get three more things unlocked to get those three things. You know what I mean? So <sighs> there's things I wish I could do, but I just kind of, I just really can't right now. So, um, yeah, kind of slow going, but thanks again for coming out. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and I will see you in the next one.